in our previous videos we've talked about front derailleur chain rub that is the chain rubbing against the inner plate of the front derailleur when the chain is in the small chain ring and large cog. Hi, I'm Tony at 2010 Speed. What happens when you get chain rub that is in the front derailleur on multiple cogs, either large or small? Let's take a look and see what we can do. We're almost always going to see some chain rub of the chain against the outer plate of the front derailleur when we're in the small chain ring and smallest cassette or we're in the large chain ring and the largest cog of the cassette. This is called cross chaining and puts a tremendous amount of pressure and tension on the chain. These are not gears that we want to use. The problem that we want to look at today is what if we're getting some chain rub on the inner plate of the front derailleur in the large cassette cog and even some of the other cogs as we shift or we're in the large chain ring smallest cassette we're getting some rubbing against the outer plate of the front derailleur even as we shift to other cogs we're still getting some rubbing let's take a look at what we can possibly do check that the limiting screws that they're properly adjusted for the front derailleur Next, check the tail of the derailleur to make sure it's not pushed too far inward or outward, which will cause some chain rub. When shifted to the large chain ring, make sure the outer plate of the derailleur sits 1 to 3 centimeters above the large chain ring. If these methods fail to cure your chain rub problem, we have methods you can try. Remove the tail screw from the front derailleur. Using a four millimeter bolt and washer, notice how we trimmed off the end of the four millimeter bolt so it doesn't stick too far through. Separate the ends of the derailleur and between the two plates at the end, go ahead and insert your washer. and then attach the bolt. This will give us a little more room between the two plates of the derailleur. Reset the limiting screws, try once more, and see if we've eliminated the rub. I hope these tips are helpful. Give me some feedback and let me know how you do. Safe riding.